Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating your apps right here on your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch. It doesn't matter which one you guys have, it's exact same instructions. So let's get started. Tap on your app store. Once you open up your app store on the top right hand corner, you're going to see a circle. You might see your name there, a letter, or maybe any picture that you put. So just tap on that picture. So from here, all you need to do is scroll down. We're going to see available updates and we can just tap on update all, which is on the top left hand side. So we're going to do exactly that. And then from here, it's going to update every single app that needs an update right now. If we scroll down, you can see more and more apps that need an update. And then if you keep scrolling even more down, you're going to see updated recently. So everything that gets updated will go into this list down here and that would be it. So no matter which iPhone you guys have, it's going to be the exact same instructions, even with iPads or even iPod touch, same instructions. Now, how do you know if they're updating? Well, we can see that circle and once it's full, then it's done the update. Now, yes, it depends how big the app is and how fast your internet speed is on how long this is actually going to take to download. So if you have faster internet speed, it's going to be a lot faster. If it's a really big app, obviously that will take longer than a smaller app. So for example, Photoshop Express would take longer than maybe an app like Facebook, usually. However, as long as you guys see this, then that means they already updated and they will just keep pushing down as they're fully updated. So right now my last one is actually Facebook. It's almost done downloading. Once it's done downloading, it's just gonna move up down to my updated recently and I shouldn't see any more apps that need that update. Now, whether you guys have automatic updates turned on or off, you might need to do this because sometimes it only updates once you hook up your iPhone, iPad, or touch some electricity to charge it up. That's when it's updating your apps. However, you may want to update an app right now before you use it. So right now, everything just updated. I shouldn't have anything else. You should just say updated recently and that's it. I'm done. Anyways, that would be it for this video. If you have any questions, comments, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.